everybody, Danny Rubino here at the Windows Phone Central, and look at this, it is a Nokia Lumia 2520, their Windows 8.1 RT tablet, or sorry, Windows RT 8.1 tablet. Uh, it is exceptionally thin and light, I love holding this device. Uh, I do like the Surface 2, as many of you guys know, but this is definitely, I think, a little bit easier to handle. Tapered edges on it, very smooth. Uh, this is the black one, obviously, and it's just a very smooth feel to it. On the back here, you have the 6.7 megapixel size lens camera, uh, f1.9 aperture, great for low light. Uh, I was told that this is the same camera module as the Lumia 720, so that's pretty interesting. Um, you see here, Verizon 4G LTE on the back, so you know who this is going for. Uh, ATT is supposed to get this as well, we'll see if we can find one of that on board. Uh, look at that display, 650 nits. Now to put that in perspective, that's a measure of the brightness. Uh, the iPad is supposed to get around 450 to 500 nits, so this is clearly a very bright screen. You also have incredible viewing angles on it. It's supposed to be 180 degrees, and um, you know that's basically flat, and it pretty much is. Uh, the display is at 1080p, and it is just probably one of the best looking ones around you're going to see. you got a corny gorilla glass 2 on top here, as well as the clear black display, and they really got the air out of the glass and lens uh, the display, so it has very low reflectivity, so you're not going to see much glare on it. You'll probably see some here with these bright lights, but in everyday usage, it should be pretty good. Other than that, you got your standard uh, Nokia Music. This is actually an exclusive Nokia Music app that's built for the 2520. Uh, we'll see if we can launch it here. I'm not sure what's exactly different with it, but we'll try to find out more later. Um, you know, you're running 8.1 here, RT, which is actually really nice. Uh, nice haptic feedback on that button when I touch it. I can feel the device really vibrate, so if you're into that, it's great. You also have your front-facing 2 megapixel camera over here. On top, your power button to disable. You have your, also your volume key. And what's really nifty here, and I didn't even mention it during the press conference, but I'll tell you, right here and right here are two front-facing speakers. So they're little cutouts in the grill. It's similar to the 925 microphones. Uh, and they basically will kind of blast the sound at you when you're playing uh, any kind of music or media. And I can tell you, it sounds absolutely fantastic because you're never going to muffle it, no matter how, old, how you hold the device. If we get in the bottom here, here's your connection for the uh, power dock. And other than that, you got your uh, some connections on the side here, including micro USB um, and HDMI video out, headphone jack, uh, and a SIM door, of course, as well. So there you go, it has a Lumia 2520. Uh, really great device. It's light, it's thin, uh, feels really good to hold. I think for consumers, you're going to really want this. It's a perfect device for when you're in your car, the couch, or just moving around. So there you go. Head to Windows Central for more information. Take care, bye.